I'm going to drill down on this uh, this this data topic a little bit because uh, there's definitely just a ton of uh, value waiting to be unlocked in government data, especially federal data. I mean, the the um, the agencies have come a long way on this, and you know things like APA, what is it, API.gov, um, really make it clear that there's a lot to work with um, in training. This conversation is kind of uh, nascent, I'd say, where a lot of the the AI or machine learning applications that we see target training data. So that might be, you know, an outcome on an assessment or a percentage of compliance. But there's a lot more than that out there, right? And you're talking about tying together some disparate systems. Um, so how can AI be used to uh, to drive uh, training outcomes or you know measure uh, your return on investment in training technology yeah i mean i think you hit on the most direct way to use ai and that's to bubble up training content but then the whole other piece that you're alluding to is using data from operations interactions experiences experiences and processes to determine what training and content that you need to put out to the workforce how quickly that they're adapting to it and also taking a look at what the standard way of doing something is or where people keep getting hung up. So when I think about it from our point of view, you know, we automate a lot of processes. And to do that, we use process discovery and process mining, which means we use technology to watch how people are doing something via technology over and over again. And it's the same repeatable process. And when it's recording that, it's also recording the outliers. So if people stray from like the normal standard way they do something, and then you take that data, you get it in an analytics and you bubble it up and then you say, well, why is that person doing that? Or why did these five people do it this way? And then that leads you to ask, are there operational issues? Maybe we're not doing it right. Or is this something that needs some remediation and can we address this via training? And that's the internal use case. And I think externally, you can use that as well. If you're expecting people to do something on a website or in, interact a certain way with your agency, you're able to then look at all the different data that's coming in and do it in a very automated fashion. Use analytics, AI, machine learning, figure out what the process should be, needs to be, and who's not doing it uh, to push out, again, customize very specific content uh, and training to those users. 